what is up yawn squad and welcome back to the vlog today we're starting out the day i'm about to jump in the swimming pool with pants on rachel's already in here right now i'm actually probably just going to end up going into my boxers i mean uh i don't really mind if my neighbors see what i got going on yeah we only got a week left here if i want to go in my pool naked i'm gonna go in my pool naked whether my neighbors want to see it or not griff you gonna come in the pool today boy you gonna come in the pool come on get in get in call him babe See if he'll get in. I feel like he only gets in when I get in the pool. He does. He doesn't get in when Come on, Griff, get in. Come on, buddy. He's like, yeah, nah, I'm waiting for my dad to go in. All right, Griff, I'm in here. Come on, boy. Come on. Come get in. If he gets in right now. Come on, boy. Come on. Come on, Griff. Come on. Come on, boy. Come on. Good boy. I told you, babe, he only gets in when I'm in here. Good boy, Griff. I you were mama's boy, Griff. Nah, he's a daddy's boy. That's my dog. That's my doggy. Dog. Good boy. We just got out of the pool and as I'm sure you guys can tell, I am starting to get a little bit of a sunburn. Rachel is gonna work on cooking up some turkey burgers for lunch and then it's grind time. We are gonna grind and get everything set up for this estate sale this weekend. Uh, I'm gonna try posting some ads and hopefully we can get some people to show up and get rid of some of the stuff in this house before we have to move out to LA. So these are the burgers that Rachel just made. I'm drooling, it's so good. Uh, <laughs> These are the burgers Rachel just made. We got turkey burgers with a little bit of cheese, onions, ketchup, and mustard. No buns, because I'm trying to cut out some carbs. So Rachel's dog sitting this dog named Greta, and I thought Chloe and Griffey shot a lot. Look at this. Just give her a little, little scratch. Look at this. Oh my gosh, she loses so much hair. I did it on her butt earlier, like this. Look at this. That is so much hair. You shed like crazy. You're a good girl though. Man, do we have a lot of work to do right now. Our main goal is we're gonna get everything out of the man cave. We already got the futon out. We're gonna get the computer desk and everything out of here. This room is gonna be completely empty. Everything that we are planning on keeping is gonna come into this room. Everything we're selling is gonna be in this living room that's right out here, the dining room, the kitchen, and then the second living room. So we have a ton of work to do, uh, but it needs to be done. We got we got to get rid of this stuff. Such a great help. I got you something right here. That's the wrong one. Yeah, I got you something right here. Look, hold on to my pocket. What? The middle finger? Yeah. <laughs> We're making quite a bit of progress. Everything that is in the man cave right now is all the stuff we're gonna be bringing to LA. I wasn't planning on bringing that much, but as we get to digging into things, I guess we have a lot more stuff we're bringing then than we thought. Still working on cleaning up a little bit. We are making progress though. Hey, yo! So much stuff out in the living room right now that we're gonna be selling. All this stuff. Will you fucking get away from me, Devin? I'm gonna fight you. I'm literally gonna bitch. fight you. Fight me. Back up. Yeah, that's what I thought, boy. Square up. Square up. Square up. What's good? <laughs> Ow, my shin! Bad position, Dev. Who's sniffing my ass? Griffey. Okay, I tap. You tap? Yeah. Griffey's nose is all up in my ass. I cut my shin on whatever I kicked. I kicked something and Devin had something in his pocket and it cut my leg. You kicked this. No, I didn't. I kicked you. Yeah, probably that lighter. Anyways, everything in this living room is up for sale. Besides the iMac over there. And me. In my opinion, we've gotten a lot of work done today, so since work is over, I think now it's playtime. Not too sure what we're gonna do or what, what we're even planning to do, but all I know is I am tired of working on this house. I told you guys that I kinda didn't know what we had planned for tonight. We decided to come out and check out the place where we were the other night where everyone was racing and the cops ended up coming. No one showed up here. The last two times we've come out here, we were planning on going through this tunnel and doing something that we probably shouldn't do. The first time we weren't able to go because Lance, Lizzie, and Chris and Rachel ended up getting into a car accident. Second time, the cops ended up busting this whole area, so we wanted to get out of here as soon as possible. But uh, now, I, I think we're gonna go check it out and see if we can do it. If you guys watched the vlog where Chris, Lizzie, Rachel, and Lance got into an accident, you guys will know what we're about to do right now. But you guys probably can't see too well, but that car right up there is actually a police officer. So, I, I don't know if we're gonna do what we were planning on doing. 
I don't know. I don't want to oh, do he's it. Going down there too, he's going that way. Okay, let's just see how far he goes. Yeah, I'd rather not. <laughs> Yolo. Yeah, no, not tonight. I'm. Nah, I want to so bad. We'll come back in a little bit. Nice little 458 here. Cody, you want to race him though? <laughs> you don't want to get pulled on. <laughs> By the Tesla. These guys would get out of my way. Oh, oh he's, he's turning. turning. Damn. You obviously wouldn't have won. I mean, your, your car's decently fast, but I don't want people to say we're fucking dumb. Yeah, <laughs> bro, obviously we're kidding. Uh, but hey, it's like some the same time I raced that F-16 fighter gun one, remember? Bro, we whooped their ass, all three of them. There was four. Was there four? Yep. We we are going so fast, I missed one of them. Yeah. You're crazy. Okay, I'm trying to record. Oh, you just stuck your tongue right in my mouth. Anyways, Devin and I decided to go for a little cruise. Honestly, nothing excited happened. There were cops everywhere tonight. It is Friday night, though, and they're always out trying to get people for drinking and driving. So I can understand why tonight like wasn't that exciting. I still have a few more things that I need to take care of around the house before we have our estate sale tomorrow. It sucks, like the vlogs are so boring right now and I wanna entertain you guys, but I'm just so busy trying to get all this stuff done, getting everything prepared so we're ready to move out to LA. And I keep saying next Saturday, but I just realized today that the 8th isn't even till next Tuesday. We still might move Saturday. I'm really not too sure yet. I still have to figure everything out. And I would definitely need a place to stay. So maybe Lance will like let me stay there for a couple days until we're ready to move everything into our apartment. Something's crawling on my leg right now and it just jumped. I don't know what the hell it was. We got bugs everywhere in this shit. Alrighty guys, so it is currently the next day. Very, very interesting start to the day already. So our estate sale starts at 10. My alarm didn't go off like it was supposed to, so I didn't wake up until 8.45. I was getting ready to head to Walmart to do some shopping to get some stuff that I need, just to clean up the house and like poster board for the signs and all that. And what do you know, my bank card's not in my phone and we couldn't find it. And now I have two pairs of pants that are exactly the same. One was in the laundry room, which I checked. Another pair was outside that I left outside yesterday when I jumped into the swimming pool. And go figure, the one that was outside by the swimming pool is the one that had it and I had no idea to even check out there because I totally forgot that I left my pants out there. So with that being said, it is now 9.20 in the morning. Estate sale starts in 40 minutes. We're headed off to Walmart right now. Very exciting day so far. Not exciting as in the fact that we did anything really exciting, but we had our estate sale. It went on from 10 a.m. till about two o'clock in the afternoon, a little closer to three. And we sold over $700 worth of stuff today. We still have the couch, we still have the TV, the entertainment center, the lamps, the end tables. But we ended up selling a lot of the little stuff that we don't need anymore. But my main concern is that we do need to get rid of this big stuff because I don't want to have to get storage when we go out to LA. So we're having this estate sale again tomorrow. Hopefully we have a little bit better turnout. Maybe we can get rid of the couch and the dining room table and quite a few other things. I guess we'll just have to wait and see what happens. Once again, I do apologize. The vlogs are boring. It's driving me nuts. Like I just want to go do fun stuff. I want to go do hood rat shit with my friends. But I can't because we have all this stuff that we, we have, have to get rid of. We have adult shit to do. Rachel said it best, you know, work hard, play later. Uh, I do apologize that the vlogs are kind of boring right now. I ask you guys, please, please, please bear with me until we get everything situated. Just know that when we get out to LA, the vlogs are gonna be steak sauce. A1, boy, A1. But with that being said, I think that is gonna wrap it up for this vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, do me a favor, hit that thumbs up button. I would really appreciate it. If you guys are not yet subscribed to my channel, make sure to smash that subscribe button. Also, Hypnotic Hoodies, we are adding tank tops to the site today. Make sure to head over and check them out. Hopefully by the time this vlog goes up, the new tank tops will be available for you guys to check out. Uh, there's gonna be some dope ones on there. I'll throw you guys some little sample images, maybe one here. Woo, maybe one here. 
They're fire. Head over, check it out. Link is going to be right in the top of the description. Thank you to everyone who has already purchased a hoodie. Your guys' support means more to me than words can ever describe. Once again, that is going to wrap it up for this vlog, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace!